I'm Ross. I'm Senior Architect with Bridgetown Design, and I'm going to talk to you a little bit today about waterproofing and drainage. If you read my blog on Tumblr, you noticed I answered a question last week uh, to one of my clients about drainage on a beach house, and uh, it brings up quite a number of issues, so I thought I would address those a little further, maybe with a sketch or two, uh, to show you what some of the newer trends in uh, basement drainage and crawl space drainage are. Uh, in a typical basement section where we have a foundation wall, a footing, and a basement slab. We waterproof the outside of the foundation wall so that groundwater can't permeate through the, through the foundation wall. And we often put a vapor barrier underneath the slab so that groundwater can't come up through the slab. The problem was, the problem is that water does still penetrate and when that water gets into your basement it's got nowhere to go. So one system we like here in the Northwest. It's a newer product it's made by a local Northwest company called John's Waterproofing. You can check them out at www.johnswaterproofing.com. And it is a perimeter drain channel system, which can be retrofitted into existing basements, or it can be designed into new basements. Uh, and it consists of a plastic perimeter channel. It sits on the footing just inside the foundation wall, and it acts to gather water off of the foundation wall, in the case of condensation or water transport through or in case of spilled water, uh, water leaks, whatever you might have, uh, on the basement slab. It'll gather that as well, and it transports it to a perimeter drain, which sits on the inside of your basement foundation. And the water gathered there is then carried to a sump pit somewhere in the basement, which simply contains a sump pump, which can be rigged to automatically turn on when water is present. And it pumps the water back out of the basement, uh, typically into the storm sewer or perimeter drain system, uh, and then off you go, the water's gone. You have a nice clean dry basement. This is an unobtrusive little channel. You can run your finishes right up and over it because most of the water gathering of the channel is behind the channel. And uh, it's, it's nearly invisible and it's a great pre preventative measure for water infiltration in basements.